We are Man on Air. Hey, dude, let's go. We're running late. Oh, 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 oh. wait, 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 wait. Oh, just wait a minute. Huh? What's the matter? Ah, uh, my anggyeong is where is it? What? Ah, my anggyeong is not able to find. So I'm finding my glasses. Uh, you're doing what? I said I'm finding my glasses. Uh, A, your English is incorrect, and B, you're already wearing your glasses. Ah, 안경 내가 이미 쓰고 있구나. Ah, 아, 근데 내 영어 표현이 틀렸다고? Yes. <laughs> what a rude friend. <laughs> First, you don't even need the glasses on your face already. <laughs> Second, <laughs> your grammar's messed up too. Wow. <laughs> I'm not a nice friend at all. <laughs> your grammar's messed up and you're wearing your glasses. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> 그리고 성함이 케빈인데 영어 잘 못하시나 봅니다. It's all good. Let's yeah. see. What did Kevin say in his message? 어, 종종 헷갈리는 표현 중 하나가 찾다입니다. 안경을 oh. 찾고 있어라고 할때 올바른 표현이 뭔가요? Oh. Well, before we explain the actual correct expression, here is a question for you all to participate. 음, 케빈님의 질문 그대로입니다. 안경을 찾고 있어의 올바른 영어 표현을 골라주세요. Number one. I'm finding my glasses. Number two, I'm looking for my glasses. Number three, I'm searching for my glasses. Oh, 어렵습니다. 보기 한번 다시 드릴게요. <웃음> Number one, I'm finding my glasses. Number two, I'm looking for my glasses. Number three, I'm searching for my glasses. 좋습니다. The Greg, okay. what is the answer? Let's see. The answer is... Number one, no two. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, number two, 정답이에요. Everybody got it wrong. Number one. No, I'm kidding, guys. Number two. 축하드립니다. Yeah. Looking for my glasses. Ah, yeah. uh, 쿠폰 당첨자를 발표하기 전에, can you explain the uh, expression a little more? What's okay. the difference between searching for and looking for, maybe? Well, honestly, number three would work, right? I'm searching for, but it's a little different. So mm. the way I was taught it when I was a kid, and it's always stuck with me. I'm looking, 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 looking. Majimak found it. Mm. Okay? So I'm looking, always looking. We're looking for something. I'm looking for my keys, looking for my car, looking for my glasses. At the end, you find it. Mm. I'm finding something doesn't even make sense. It doesn't mean you're acting. So mm. I'm looking, looking, looking. Majimak find. Ah. Okay? The result is find something, not action. Now, searching mm. is a step up from looking. Mm. I'm searching for love. <gasps> oh. I'm searching for happiness. Oh. You can't physically touch those. It's something that's it's a huge, like, looking. Like, mm. I'm looking for love. You can't touch it. I'm searching for love. Oh. I'm searching for happiness. So those are those big things that you actually can't really, like, Yo, touch. Okay. 어려워, right? 좀 어렵긴 합니다만, yeah. uh, I'm pretty sure everyone gets yeah, it. Yeah, looking for something yeah. you can physically touch. Find it. You actually have it. Searching something huge. Okay, simple. 네. 손에 잡힐 수 있는 네. 거를 이거 looking. 어 육체적으로 잡을 수 있는 걸 looking이라고 하고 looking 잡을 수 phone. 없는 거 약간 감정적인 거나 그런 네. 걸 표현할 땐 searching이라는 표현. 어 정말 Hopefully. 정말 아주 좋은 영어 교실이 아니었나 싶습니다. 완벽해요. 보통 looking. 어, 좋습니다. 두 번째 사연 한번 만나 볼게요. Here we go. 헤이준, hey, I'm finishing early today. Wanna go for some samgyeopsal? Uh, sorry. 오늘 야근이야. Then how about tomorrow? 아, 내일은 부모님 생신이라. <sighs> All right. Uh, then how about the day after tomorrow? Then you think you'll be free then? No. 아, yeah. 어쩌지? I have a promise with my friends that day. <laughs> you have what? I, I, 그러니까. 나 약속 있다니까. I have a promise with my friends. (웃음) (웃음) 
I miss voice acting. I used to do that a lot. You before, did? I used to, yeah, before last year, I was doing it regularly, but then Corona hit and people weren't wow. doing a lot of Actually, recording. Really, so. really well. I used to really enjoy doing it. It's fun. Mm. Anyway, uh, <laughs> fun message today from 6664. 6664님께서 친구랑 약속 있다는 표현을 영어로 그대로 직역해서 I have a promise with my friend 라고 하면 어색한가요? 라고 질문해 주셨습니다. All right. Well, before we explain this a bit more, of course, we're going to give you your pop quiz for you to participate. 나 친구랑 저녁 약속 있어를 영어로 뭐라고 할까요, Greg? Number one, I'm meeting up with my friends for dinner. Number two, I have a promise with my friends. Number three, I have a dinner appointment with my friends. 어, 어렵습니다. 다시 한번 읽어드리도록 하겠습니다. 보기 드릴게요. Slowly. Number one, I'm meeting up with my friends for dinner. Number two, I have a promise with my friends. Number three, I have a dinner appointment with my friends. Oh, 나 친구랑 저녁 약속 있어. 요 표현 어떻게 하는지. <웃음> 좋습니다. Mr. Greg, uh, 정답을 발표해 주세요. Okay, let's see. <�ugh음> the answer is number one. 아, 정답은 1번입니다. <웃음> And I'm not joking. It, oh. it is number one. But number three works too. But it's a little not the perfect one. So that's mm. that's what we'll go with. So I'll say number one is the more natural one. That's okay. why we went with number one. Number yeah. one이 뭐였죠? Number one was I'm meeting up with my friends for dinner. Ah, yeah. 너무 아깝습니다. Yeah, number three sounds like you're like going on like a business meeting or something. 그쵸. I have a dinner appointment with my friends. What appointment? Are they your friends or not? Yeah. 그러니까 <laughs> 예를 들어 한국말로 어, oh, 나 친구랑 저녁 먹어야 돼. 이게 number one이고 uh, yeah. 3번 같은 경우는 나는 친구와 저녁 약속이 예정되어 있는 어포인트먼트가 oh, 있어 이 정도로 얘기하는 거기 때문에 <웃음> 그렇죠 1번이 맞겠죠 yeah, 아 right. 어떡하지 너무 많은 분들이 3번을 뽑아주셨는데 Well it just shows how commonly people hear it so maybe that's why they feel True. that way And two the same I have a promise that's actually not even talking about dinner It's like you're engaged to your friend <웃음> <웃음> I have a promise with my friend What? You engaged or you promised? Oh. Yeah, it's totally different. But 그러네요. You always hear promise in Korea, so yeah. it's so normal, but no, it's not right. That's number two, definitely 아, not right. Yeah. 3번이 아니었다고 합니다. 네. <laughs>